Welcome back to my channel or of course welcome to my channel if you're new. If you are new then hello, lovely to meet you. My name is Alex and if you are new here make sure you stick around and subscribe if you're not new and you've been here for a while then why not make sure that notification bell is switched on just so you're notified of every single time that I upload. Now for today's video I've got a short and sweet one for you because we are going to be doing another P. Louise budget box unboxing. So as you guys know if you've been watching all of these unboxings of mine I have been doing this since she initially 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 launched them i have been happy with them every single month and these are so worth the money if you absolutely love p louise you have to check these out if you haven't already i've got a few of these up already if you want to see what's been in the previous boxes but as a massive p louise fan to another if you are one strongly recommend getting these boxes they're literally 30 pounds a month and you get exclusive new items in there as well as some like other favorites and things you can just build on your collection or have backups or if you're in my case i like to keep them aside for giveaway prizes so yeah let's get into it so this is the july budget box she launches them really late in the month sometimes at the beginning of the next month but this is the july one um, and they always come in these cute little pink boxes and oh Oh my god, this month is so good. I literally say that every month, but this month is literally so good. So, quick little sneak peek. Oh my god. If you do want to find out what's inside the July budget box, then please keep watching. Another thing to know is the budget box is always £30 every month. It doesn't get any higher, it doesn't get any lower, and the contents of the, of the box is always at least £60, £70 pounds worth of products. So yeah, definitely recommend so the first thing you get in the july budget box is one of these brushes these are one of her 7171 brushes that she puts in i think in all of her like paint packs and stuff like that I'm, well i'm pretty sure it is anyway it looks quite big actually no i'm wrong it, it's not the one she puts in the crisp finish packets and stuff this is the 7072 brush this is the 7071 this is quite a big brush for me i don't know if i'd be able to use that for cut creases but maybe for like shimmers on the lid um or something so this is what the brush looks like up close it's just like a big rounded flat brush like it's quite thin um yeah it'd definitely be too big for me in terms of cut creases but i'll most definitely find a use for this so this is the first item okay next you got a colored base now everyone in my patreon group got the same colored base so i don't know if every single person that got the budget box got this shade but all of us got the cute in coral eye base now if you do get this in your box and you're thinking i can't even use that on my eyes i wouldn't wear that on my eyes use it as a cream blush because it's absolutely stunning i also use the pretentious peach shade as a cream blush and a couple of the pinks as well so yeah bit of another hack for you if you don't want to use it on your eyes definitely use it as a cream blush these retail for about 10 pounds each i believe um so yeah these boxes are just they're just such good value for money i can't even deal um so i'm gonna put this actually in my giveaway box because i already have this okay this next thing if you are a makeup artist you are never gonna run out of this p louise base so she actually put a 50 mil base in this box so i actually have so much of this i have a normal size one i have the 30 mil one and now i have a 50 mil one this is in the shade room 02 um yeah it's just absolutely massive like even the thing at the bottom is quite big like the little tube part um yeah i just i don't even think i don't think i need this if you know me if you watch my reviews and like eyeshadow palette reviews you know that i always use my revolution one anyway um i do like the p louise one i just reach for the revolution one much more so i just i can't see myself using this so i'm probably gonna either put it in my giveaway box or try and sell that the next two items though i cannot tell you how excited i am for them so when Paige was showing us on our stories what was in the box she said that a lot of people requested p louise skin in these boxes and to be honest same because her skincare is quite expensive so she included the moisturizer this month this is the dreamy and dewy for all skin types 
moisturizer <laughs> even the packaging is just so beautiful and wait till you see what the actual bottle looks like oh my goodness i just i absolutely love it she kills it with her packaging always um so this is what the bottle looks like i actually thought it was going to be a lot heavier than this um because i think this is about 30 pounds it's not cheap at all um so there's a hundred mil in here and i think this would last you a really long time my friend carly said she's used this and it's really good so oh look it just pulls off like that and then oh my god it's like a little dispenser i just love her packaging um so yeah this item i was extremely excited for um i moisturize literally every single day and night so i am always on the hunt for like new moisturizers and stuff so i'm very excited to use this okay so as i mentioned at the start you do get exclusive items in these boxes and there was just one exclusive item in this box which is very exciting and this is the brow beans eyebrow palette so this is what the packaging looks like absolutely love it and basically this is like a brow powder palette now i actually used to use powders all the time for my brows instead of like an eyebrow pencil and now i've got this palette i'm definitely going to start reaching for brow powders again so this is what the palette looks like and then look there's little lights on the mirror and then these are all of the brow powders so in here you get all of her current brow shades you get blonde blend gingerbread latte hazelnut latte i can never pronounce that machino no because that's the brand isn't it mochaccino goodness me i'm terrible and espresso so these are especially good for muas to use these because you've got all of the brows covered um but i'm yeah i'm particularly excited about this and again i just love the packaging because it's got little light ups on there and it's just so cute i love it and it feels really like sturdy and luxurious so i'm very happy with this month's box yet again so that is everything you've got in this month's budget box another quick side note if you are not signed up to the p louise takeover facebook page highly recommend okay we always get early access to anything that page launches and with the budget box we always get the link a couple of days before it even launches to the public so yeah if you want to keep on top of these highly recommend signing up to the facebook page and keep updated on their page so that's the end of this video i really hope you enjoyed it and if you did please let me know by smashing the thumbs up button why didn't i do that oh my god um by smashing the thumbs up button let me know down below what you think of this month's box and of course if you haven't already please subscribe down below and i will see you in my next video Bye.